Hey guys, it's Gary Dean. Uh, I'm working on this uh, BMW X5M again. This is a pretty regular occurrence for me, but I got a, a question regarding how I clean inside the door switches. And to be honest with you, it's really not complicated. I clean pretty much everything on an interior with a microfiber, including your vents. Um, if I, if my towel isn't saturated, I will just wet the tip of it, wet the tip. <laughs> anyway, um, I will just stick the microfiber in the vents and get all the dust and dirt out of there. Uh, that's not super complicated, but I don't, I don't use a lot of brushes on the interior. I, the only thing I use brushes on really is the, uh, the wheels. So I'll just go in there and stick the microfiber in there uh, and that's really the same thing with the door switches the window switches and that kind of thing uh, if they're really bad you could use a q-tip to get down in there um, I, I haven't found uh, any situation where uh, my the tip of a microfiber and just pressing it in there and moving it around won't work um, it is electrical I would refrain from using any heavy cleaners uh, that might seep down into there, but you know on occasion I will spray some infinite use detail juice right there on the switch and use my finger to get it out of there. I don't I don't think that that's uh, well, I've never had any issues or had that cause any problems for me um, Again, it's about not oversaturating, and you know I would just use the lubrication to break some of that stuff down. I wouldn't use a heavy cleaner on that area. I mean, these obviously weren't bad, but I wanted to give an example of where I was at. I actually saw the dusty vent. I wanted to show you guys that's how I clean vents and that kind of thing. But uh, as far as the door buttons and stuff like that, just don't get them too saturated. But it's okay to use um, a light lubrication type product like the Infinite Use Detail Juice uh, in those areas if there's dirt and grime in there that you can't get out uh, without using some kind of lube. This vehicle stays pretty clean. Uh, it's well uh, taken care of. I maintain it. So... Uh, it doesn't get nasty, but if you had a smoker or someone who ate in the car a lot or like if, if there were kids in the back seat and they got lots of nasty uh, stuff inside the window situation, it would be a little bit different. But in this particular situation, it's not real bad. And, uh, you know, most of what I take care of these days are cars uh, that are on the nicer side. Uh, I don't get a whole lot of calls now for filthy, nasty vehicles. I don't have a lot of time to deal with that kind of thing. But as far as the buttons, that's how I do it. Thanks so much for watching. If you've got any questions, 813-846-4406. Check out DetailJuice.com for my products. And check out Gary Dean's Detail Juice Nation. It is a group on Facebook where we talk about only my products and my processes. Uh, and you can get an unbiased opinion from other people there besides myself, which obviously I'm biased. I feel like my stuff is the best stuff on the planet, obviously. Uh, so I would tell you that they're awesome. But there are far many, 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 many more people who feel the same way I do. And if you want to talk to some of those people that use my products on a daily basis, check out Gary Dean's Detail Juice Nation on Facebook. If I can help you in your detailing endeavor, 813-846-4406. Thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful day.